A beloved business owner shot and killed in broad daylight right inside his antique shop. We Ridge police telling us today they believe it happened during a possible robbery. Denver 7's Christian Lopez spoke with those who knew and loved the victim and brings us the latest on this investigation. Loved ones have identified the victim as Peter Damien Arguello, who is the owner of this beloved antique shop in Wheat Ridge. You can see this growing memorial outside of his business. And we spoke with his close friends who say this is a tremendous loss for the community. But if you went inside, you could lose yourself for hours because he had these amazing like antiques. He knew all the stories behind how, where they came from and how they were obtained. A business just as unique. Not only did he like buy and sell jewelry, but he also created like custom jewelry. I bought my wife's wedding ring from him. And as special. He was everybody's best friend. As its owner. Just a genuine, good-hearted soul. We live in a world full of hate and evil, but people like Peter reminded you that there's a lot of good all around us. Friends are remembering Peter Damien. He was a big integral part of the community. After he was shot and killed in his own shop. It's very scary to see broad daylight crime like this. Leaving the Wheat Ridge community in shock. It could happen to anybody if it can happen to him. And he was one of the biggest people as far as security goes on his business. Police say it all happened during a possible robbery Wednesday morning. They have identified this red Chevy Silverado as the suspect vehicle. It's hard to fathom how people or an individual could do this to, to anyone. Um, it obviously hits closer when you know them personally. But loved ones are still left with no answers about who did it. Peter, we're all thinking about you and we're thinking about your family right now. We love you very much. We, we thank you for all that you have given us as individuals into the community and our hearts go out to your family. Um, we can only hope that these people are brought to justice. Peter leaves behind a wife and a son. Right now, Wheat Ridge PD is not releasing how many suspects are involved, but they are looking for that red Chevy Silverado. Anyone with information is urged to call the police department. In Wheat Ridge, I'm Christian Lopez, Denver 7.